Amanda Serrano on headlining over Jake Paul. I'm used to performing, sitting in the crowd and watching Jake perform. Amanda Serrano has led a career more than worthy of a starring role any time she is in the ring. That said, the seven division titleist is admittingly still thrown off by the supporting cast for her up and coming home headliner. Serrano will defend her lineal and unified WB, IB, IB, and WB Featherweight Championship versus Berlin's Nina Mainki. The scheduled 12-round bout will top the bill for a March 2nd DAZN show from Puerto Rico and San Juan that will include Jake Paul in the co-feature slot versus a secured opponent who will be revealed by the end of the month. The role reversal comes after Serrano has fought in the co-main event for three shows headlined by Jake Paul. I'm supposed to be performing, sitting in the crowd and watching Jake perform, Serrano admitted during a press conference held Thursday in San Juan to formally announce the event. Now I have to watch him and then go out and perform. I'm going to be a nervous wreck in the locker room. End quote from Amanda Serrano. The undercard will also feature two boxers managed by Serrano. WBO junior flyweight titleist Jonathan Bomba Gonzalez, whose boxing record stands at 27 victories with three defeats, with one draw, with 14 vicious wins coming by Naka, who defends versus fellow countryman and interim WBO titleist Rene Santiago, a first-year junior bantamweight prospect, Cristo Rosaro, who's 2-0 with one knockout, who's bout versus Mongolia, who's five victories, no losses with two knockouts, will also be fought at three-minute rounds in a four-round affair. Ah, there you go. There you go, Gloria. The arrangement to have Serrano, a 34-year-old Brooklyn-bred Southpaw who lives in California, take the lead for their fourth shared car together was insisted upon by Jake Paul, whose boxing record stands at eight victories, one losses with five knockouts. The 27-year-old influencer and rising cruiserweight lives in nearby towns in whatever whoopty wop but wants this night to be all about his company, most valuable promotion, first and highest profile signee, Amanda Serrano, whose boxing record stands at 46 victories, two defeats, with one draw, with 30 vicious knockouts, has fought just four times before on her beloved island. The stacked event for her latest main event was perfectly timed as she will enter her 50th pro bout of a 15 year career that has seen her win <laughs> at least one title at every weight from junior bantamweight all the way through junior welterweight. More history was accomplished last February by Serrano, who became Puerto Rico's first ever undisputed champion after her blood-soaked points win over Erica Cruz at Madison Square Garden in the Hulu Theater in New York City. New York, New York, New York! Two fights later, Serrano stood firm on her bout taking place over 12 three-minute rounds with rather than three two-minute round distance normally afforded woman's title fight. The same terms will apply to the IBF mandatory title defense versus Ma 
Inky, whose boxing record stands at 18 victories, three defeats, with four vicious knockouts. For Serrano's first fight in Puerto Rico since a March 2021 ninth round stoppage over three division champ Danila Bermudez in Old San Juan. Paul and MVP co-founder Nakisha Badarian wanted to make the night a special one for the island for which he was more than content to play a supporting role. He told me flat out, no way that he was going to be the main event here, Serrano said of the conversation she had with Paul with whom he she with whom she signed in 2021. So not only do I have to watch him, I have to watch Crystal Rosado, Bomba Gonzalez as well, but I'm going to be ready to perform. End quote from Amanda Serrano. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know in the comments section what y'all think about Jake Paul being a goddamn sportsman of no other, taking the back seat for his co-signee, letting the people know that it's just bigger than the individual. It's about the sport. Everybody can get the same love that I get. Ladies and gentlemen, changing the sport. Let me know in the comments section what you think. Have a good one. Cause we've been through some